Oshkosh Defense is currently working on a U.S. military contract building joint light tactical vehicles. And with the changes at Manitowoc Company, the Oshkosh contract could help get more jobs filled. Local 5's Donald Robinson has the story. The joint light tactical vehicle made by Oshkosh Defense could be the key to getting hundreds of people back to work, including some of the 500 who were recently given notice of layoffs by Manitowoc Company. We've had a couple job fairs. We're in the process of hiring over 300 people. Oshkosh Defense is in the process of building 17,000 JLTVs for the U.S. military. The contract is for eight years, and the vehicles started coming off the assembly line last week. This, this truck is... Uh... It's just really awesome. It's got the off-road mobility of, of like no other vehicle in the world. It uh, lots of wheel travel. It's got uh, the survivability of an MRAP, uh, which we saw in our MATVs in the, in the Middle East. Uh, it's got the, the armor of a light tank. And again, it's uh, like a Baja racer. We actually ran the Baja race with it. The contract for the JLTV is just under $7 billion. U.S. Senator Tammy Baldwin started legislation to fund and move the JLTV program forward. That is a... Uh, a vehicle that is going to uh, keep our troops safe and well into the future. Oshkosh Defense has a lot of opportunity internationally for the JLTV. U.S. allies are also placing orders for the vehicles. We do see this as a, a, a nice program that we're going to be, uh, be growing, and it's foundational to us uh, here as far as an eight-year contract. And then you know, our goal will be to extend the contract and continue uh, abilities in the future. In Oshkosh. Donald Robinson, Local 5 News. Thank you, Donald.